Hello, welcome back. I'm Disco Breaking, and uh, this is episode eight of us playing Foundation, the difficult way. So here we are. It's all gone a bit peak tong. It's all a bit of a mess. I'm definitely not started this how we should have done. But nevertheless, this is where we are. Uh, let's get cracking. Um, put the UI on. There we go. Oh, a town in debt. An awkward silence settles over the Great Hall. As one of your villagers asks for coins that you don't have. Well, we clearly got money. Um, so I think this is just a little bit of a... I've seen it do this before. Starving villagers. No, that's not true. Shush, go away. Go away. Right, so we are building a monastery. All the way up here. Look at that. Uh, a couple of dorms. We've got a scriptorium. And we're going to have a monastic garden in a second. We're just going to add that now. So, so select a function. Nope. Back. Build. Right, select a function. Um, monastic garden. And then we're going to have herb planters. I'm only doing herbs the American way. Let's try and center that up a little bit. So let's have all the monks coming in and the nuns coming in from the... From the right, so shift, two, three, four, and then we'll have a berries planter, one, uh, two, three, four, a bit close, but there we go, here's what it is, build that, lush, Okay, so let's stick this as a priority. Now I did notice that if we come down here. We've got one unemployed, we've got two unemployed people and I presume that they are nuns or holy types, but it says that we've got three copyists assigned. So maybe it's just because we've not got any monks on berry picking duty as of yet. So we need to wait for someone to come in so we can add an extra person. We're going to get rid of these trees here. This logging camps has done it has done its work, so we'll get rid of this one. Um, let's destroy that, and let's build another one up here, just out on this bluff. Boom, boom, outside territory. Outside territory. There we go. Pop it there. And then we can. Get it to extract around this. Monastery for us. So we have a nice. There we go. A nice clear area for our. Monastic. Wants. Ways. I don't know. Needs. Let's just take all of that away from extraction. All of this, in fact. There we go. It's not the it's not the tidiest, is it? Um. Don't need any of that extracted. Just these trees here, really. Now I built a little sheep farm up here right at the end of the last episode, so hopefully that will come along. Uh, let's turn the taxes off. Oops. Right, so we've got 200 coins. Is there anything we can do in the book? Yes, there is. Now, we could have a... On the common path, we could have a brewery. No, it's a tooling, a beer production, or a luxury market, and a sculpture workshop. That could be handy. Um, under labour, a tavern... We don't really need that at the moment. Milling taxes. Now I said we weren't going to do any taxes, but I think that we will. So we'll unlock that. We've got 36 labor influence, so we can unlock that. Um, which one of these should we choose? Let's just do that initial edict or privilege, sorry. And we'll enact that here. Uh, there we go. 
Uh, nothing to in there. Not interested in the kingdom. So let's also have more. Hmm. Right, I don't really want any of that at the moment. So we'll just uh, hang out. Let's see what this advice is. The fishermen are thankful for the blueprint as a bridge is definitely going to bring their community to the forefront. As thanks, they would like uh, to trade a fair number of fish for some of your stones. Yes, we've got um, 127 stones. So you just do that straight away. There we go. Thank you for the bridge blueprint. Uh, the fishermen handed over a fair amount of goods, 50 fash. So we've got fish over here. What we could do, which would be quite nice, is if we put some tents on these stools. So I'll let that a nice little market tent. Build you up. Put a nice tent on your fancy common wear stall. Although in a minute, I think what we're going to start doing is start our cloth production. And we'll stop importing these common wares for stupid amounts a week and we'll just replace that with common clothes. We'll do that as soon as our sheep farm is built. Missing raw materials. So missing wheat, that crop is just about to come in. Don't have to worry about that. What we're selling up here, we are selling bread and berries. Now, just the addition of the market. Um, what's the word I'm looking for? The market tent will increase the capacity of our markets. Considerably. Right, what am I doing there? There, go like that. Let's have a tent over the top. Is that a red one? There we go. Build you. Lovely. Okay. The merchant requests an audience. Where are we here? The elders are looking to repair a few bridges across the region. One of the mer merchants noticed your woodcutter camps and wants to make you an offer. Um, accumulate 100, get 100 coin and 10 influence. Yes, we will 100% have that because we've got 325 in there. There we go. You delivered the goods on time. The merchant appreciated that and promised good words to their leader. Okay. See if we can get some minerales. Not there. Not there. Right. right. Let's see what's in, in here. Oh, no. I don't know. Wish we get some uh, people soon. Two days. Just looking forward to free up some people or free up a person. We can free up a person here. Mm -hmm. No. We need a person on the stone as well. Yeah. So everything's on a go slow. Let's come back when this has been built. Right, let's prioritize it first. Right, now I'll see you in a second. Okay, and we're back. Our uh, farm has been built and the bad weather has arrived. So here we go. So we've got our farm. Let's apply a shepherd. That's a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There we go. Seven sheeps, and what we need to do is 
We're going to stick a lumber camp in here as well. Like so. And then we're just going to use those to clear out this little bit of trees here. Around the old farm. There we go. And we'll just make sure that we just... There we go. So, we've got new villagers. That's excellent news. One, two, and... When neighbouring priests were strolling around the village, you heard them talk of a, a pious merchant from Northbury offering lower prices to faithful, such as you and your folks. A good relationship with the clergy could uh, let you benefit from their fair prices. I've a few coins can't buy. No. There we go. Um, the pious merchant has been uh, has been convinced to deliver your products at fairer prices for a little while. A trade bonus, a trade bonus of ten percent with the village with labour allegiance, and that's Northbury. I believe we got all of our shit from Northbury. Has this been built up here yet? No, but look, our lad is very busy. Trying to find out what's stuck behind these rocks. Let him go. Right. Okay, our scriptorium is on its way. We're not fast enough. Because we've got no workers, no builders. And of course they're all the way over here, that doesn't help. There we go. Excellent, two new. Okay, so now we've got our farm on the go. We need our other farming. There we go. So we're going to need a weaver hut. Let's pop the weaver hut here, like so. Like that. And then let's build. Let's build a warehouse like that, and then on the other side of the road, we'll build a tailor's workshop. There we go. When we've got some money, so we can store our wool and our cloth and our clothes in there ready to be shipped off to where they're needed. Excellent, more newcomers to man our new residences or our new buildings. Plenty of coin coming in. Has that a scout guy discovered what's up on the bluff yet? No. Ah, our scriptorium is built. Excellent. So our herbs will be built next. Does the scriptorium need a door, people? I'm guessing it does. Has it got a door? Have we built a door? No. Just uh, give it a little door, shall we? Be rude not to. Build. Our first planter, brilliant, and we've got one herbalist. All right, new peeps, come in, come, welcome one, welcome all. all right, we're going to need you for important textiles production. And we've got a coin now, so let's build that. So, yeah, if we added wheat to here. Then, it means this farmer is not carrying all the transporter from up here. Where is it? Uh, all up here isn't coming all the way down here.
Right, so he has. He's back. He's back once again with the ill behaviour, Kenneth. And it is iron. Right, so what we're going to need to do is unlock... Common path, we're going to need to unlock tooling. And obviously we're going to need to unlock this tile as well. Okay. All right, let's come back when this lot are built. Okay, so that's the tailor's workshop built, but I've also noticed that we're running quite low on the old berries, so let's add another forager here and another forager here. I won't add a tailor until we've got a weaver. Is it tailor, weaver? Yeah, until we've got a weaver. So. Let's come back when we've got a weaver. And there we have it, our uh, weaver's hut. Let's add a weaver. Now, I think that's us. Oh no, and we've got a weaver and a tailor. Now we've got to remember to add another weaver here. How's our logging camp coming on? It's not. Right, so we can actually spin that round and we'll just pop that on priority and we'll take a slip over here. See how our church is getting on. Our, oh, look at this. We've got none. We've got our berry picker. Newcomers approaching, which is what we really need. We just need more people in at the moment. And I'm going to want to put a nice well right in the middle of your path, like so. Brilliant. Okay. Now then, can we unlock this yet? No, we can't. So what are we looking at? 150 coinage. We're not unlocking that anytime soon, are we? Okay, so we've got reached the uh, notable clergy tier. Nice, nice, which will have unlocked all of this stuff down here. Look at this. And we've got loads. Oh, we haven't. We've got seven clergy influence. So we choose wisely. Right, let's unlock the Hospitium. Lovely. Now, can we get that bill up here? Eventually, obviously. So the well's in the middle. If we... Hospitium, like so. Now, what sort of building should we have for Hospitium? Let's have a rustic passageway. Where around does it go? Okay, let's base it like so. And just raise it up one. Lovely. Let's give it a humble door. A Kate humble door. And we'll build that. Our monastery is coming along absolutely lovely now, isn't it? So We've got all these people here. One, two, three, four. Excellent. And you, what do you want? The Bishop Stuart has heard of your interest in building a hospitium. Right. Now, I don't want to do this just yet. I've done it now. Hmm, this is a problem. I think I've created myself a problem now. Right, priority. Two builders are bringing resources. Have we got stone down here? We've got stone down here. Okay. You're building a house. That's nice. A courier is approaching. Let's put these jobs 
Let's get these jobs going, shall we? So, let's load you up. The quicker you're built. So the quicker this is built, the better. Okay. The elders would like you to host a regional fair. This is an occasion to open up more trading opportunities by celebrating the fruit of hard labour. Make sure the mood is the fair stays high, your people will do the rest. Hosting the regional fair, 21 days. Uh, raise the happiness of the village to over 50. Well, we're at 82, so that can't be a problem. Wait for the fair to be over. Get in there. Thank you. All right, that's all getting a bit crazy, so I'm going to turn the speed down to two. Another courier. Uh, the wandering monks have returned are still seeking supplies. No, we're not going to help them with that because we're in the middle of the rainy season and I don't want to run out of food. Host to region fair. So that's everything, isn't it? New advice can be heard. Your monastery is doing quite well. Some novices who devoted themselves to the faith think it's time for promotions. Such recognition would let them take on the adv advanced roles such as refractory head, cooks or beekeepers. We'd definitely promote a nun. We need 10, we need 10 scriptures and we've got three. Now we've only got two copyists. So I think we're gonna need, have we got anyone else we're gonna add to the faith? Yes, and no. But I want you, you can't assign these manually, unfortunately. I don't think. Have a look in the book. Let's have a look at people. No, we can't. That's a shame. Never mind. Right. We will come back once our hospitium is built. Okay, so while we've been waiting for that to build, we've successfully built our monastery at last. It's taken quite a while, hasn't it? And uh, we're just going to finish off this hospitium now. Oh, while we wait, we've got a couple of newcomers arrive. Excellent, you can come and join the fold. So we'll add that extra one to the weaver's hut. And as soon as this is built, we can start storing our wares. There we go. So we've got a transporter and we want to assign wool and we want to assign cloth and we want to assign clothes. Brilliant. So over here on our market here, what we can do is we can trade that for clothes. And we will also pop a hood on it. Can we put a nicer one? Yes, lovely. Nicer one than that. Go. Okay, hang on, let's slow down. Some of the visitors had a great time and cheered up your villagers. Happiness bonus of 15% for villagers with citizen, commoner, or serf status. Well, that's everybody, so that's great. We've got 92% happiness. Keep trying to turn that off. Right, here we go. Got a load of new villagers arriving. Now we are full. We are full in the church. So let's do nothing about it for the moment. I don't know what this one unemployed person is that we can't give a job to. Unemployed. Okay, well, let's make him a transporter then. There we go. Lovely. How are we doing up here for the hospitium? Our well's nearly built. Yes, the hospitium is built. We built the hospitium for the enjoyment of all visitors. As promised, the Bishop Stuart will visit, visit, visit your village soon. Okay, well, I think that that 
is the perfect point to leave it. I've been Disco Breaking, we've been playing Foundation, and if you've enjoyed this, do us a favour, drop us a like and a subscribe, and I'd really appreciate that. Bye for now.